Again, fetal position, roll it over. Firing range position, make sure everything is safe. Notice the bell's not over my face, that would be stupid. It's out here to the side. Safety measure. Drive up to the elbow. Own this position. Own the palm. Drag through. Get set, drive. Big step back. Pull it in. Nice leg sweep. Stacked and packed. Boom. Drive it around the head. And other side. Press up. Drop. Notice these are 45 ang degree angles. I'm not out here. Here is going to be a healthier position for my shoulder as I drive up. Quiet knee. Beautiful. Excellent. All right, guys, we're going to do our second set of goblet squats for five. And one of the things I want you to think about when you're goblet squatting, you're not just falling into the hole, right? That, that's lazy. What I want you to do is think about pulling yourself in, short pause, don't lose any tension, and drive yourself out. That's going to make you a stronger squatter. All right, so here we go. Sniff in, pull. Pause. Good. You can do 10 sloppy reps. Or you can do five beautiful reps and reap better benefits. Good. I don't know about you, but I don't got a lot of time to dick around in the gym, so I try and own every single movement. All right, here we go to plank. Everybody's favorite. Elbows under the shoulders. Lock out the legs. Pull the glutes in. And get tight. Tighter. Come on. If you're not shaking, you're not doing it. Five, four, three, two, one. Whew. Working out's easy to fake, you know? If you, if you just take your time and go through this stuff nice and nice and solid and make every rep count, you're going to get so much done. So much done. All right, so let's go back to our last get up. 